Two years apart, these two fighters with similar height and some differences in reach. Well, no better way to pay homage to the history of pride in the UFC with this single night UFC Grand Prix tournament. Some of the best fighters in the world have come out. Let's see who will be the last fighter standing here tonight. Excellent job of timing these combinations. He faints with the kick. Nice leg kick. Wow, that was a quick takedown. Yeah, no good. Well, he oh, he's rocked. Oh, he might be oh. out. Oh. Man. How about that chin? Oh, huge shot there. Such good movement in there. Take the body. kick for the knockout. Well, yeah, Joe, you want to talk about execution, and he just couldn't have done it any better than that. He is known for his kicks, and that was just a perfectly placed and timed kick. Full force, landed flush, full extension with the leg, and you knew that if his opponent didn't get the guard up, that was going to be the end of the night, and he went good night. And here we see it one more time. Look at the timing in this shot. Boom. And there he is after the huge knockout turned in tonight. Near perfect execution. And one of the big... Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bogliano is going to stop to this contest at 1 minute, 54 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Iceman, Chuck Lowe. So there's the man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here.